Hey everybody, it's Crackers. Welcome back to another episode here on House Flipper. So if you remember from last time, we sold the home and car. Yeah, and we made some money and now we're at $200,000 almost and we're picking a new car, or a new car, a new house to flip. So I think I'm gonna go with I think I'm gonna stick with the, the 60s here. I was thinking of jumping ahead, but you know, eventually we're gonna to have to do them all. So let's do house with uninvited guests. Yeah, let's go there right now. Let's see what we have in store for us. So obviously we're gonna to have to clean up a whole lot. So let's just get rid of this front stuff. Oh gosh, we have cockroaches already. This is not a good sign at all. Um, okay, so let's pull out the vacuum cleaners. Just get rid of these guys really quick. Suck you guys all up. Oh gosh, they're all up the wall too. Okay, I think we've almost got them all. Ooh, this house looks really messy. I love peering in there, but let's have a look at it from the outside. It's a nice shape. I don't mind the shape of it. Oh, this will be fun. So this is the house that I am going to uh, use. Ooh, I don't want to go in the back door. Blech. I'm going to use Lucky Phil's suggestion of using blues in this one. So I'm excited to try that. I don't remember seeing that. That's weird. Okay, let's see what we have. Oh, this is weird. A front entry. This is different. Oh, and the bathroom's right here. We have a tub for a change. <gasps> I'm kind of excited about that. So we have a towel radiator. Oh, this looks like it's in good condition. I'm kind of curious about this toilet. Oh my gosh, this is... <gasps> we can even use the tub. This is looking really good. Wow, okay. Does this clean up? Oh, that's that thing that we always buy. Wow, okay. Okay, so we have this front entry. And what do we have in here? A bedroom, if you so desire. Huh, interesting furniture, green. Lots of plastering to do. Okay, what's in here? Oh, it's a double door. How interesting is this? Okay, oh, and it's one big room. This is a nice size, actually. Yes, I really like this size. And look, no radiator in the way. Unless there's one that has to go in, but it doesn't look like it. That's gonna be fun. Okay, cool. So is that it? Is there some, oh, there's something else here. Okay, so this is another sort of bedroom kind of area. Okay. You guys, I'm excited about this. And look at, there's that picture, but it's all wrecked. Oh, it's actually in good shape. We're gonna save some money here. Is there any different pictures? Look at all these pictures we can reuse. There's a pair of jeans. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, we're gonna we're gonna use these. We're gonna put them in the bedroom. They're gonna be decoration. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited about this. This is gonna be awesome. Even this bedroom, I'm really excited. So excited, I'm jumping on the bed. All right, okay, so it, obviously I have some cleaning up to do. I'm glad that those actually all picked up um, together. I usually have to pick them all up separate. I'm really excited that we have a bathtub. Wow, this is so cool. Ah, I'm just really excited about this. So I am going to get busy cleaning this place up. We'll see what we can get done. Uh, and then I think we'll get started on a room. It's gonna take me a while to clean this puppy. And I don't know if it's boring for you guys to watch all this, but we're gonna do the outside of this house too, I think. 
We didn't do the outside of the last one, and I haven't done the outside of a few of them already. So, but, but the last one was actually, it looked really nice on the outside, I thought, so I didn't think it was necessary. But anyway, there's a lot of stuff to, to clean up here. So I'm gonna do this for a bit, and then I'll bring you guys back. But look how many boxes there is. These people had a ton of little boxes. I would keep some of those, but they look like they're kind of wrecked. So, okay, I gotta get rid of these things. All right, guys, I think I have this place pretty cleaned up. It's not looking too bad. I mean, there's obviously stuff I have to get rid of. Like this chair looks great. This bed, not so much. I'm not sure about these cabinets yet. They don't look the greatest. I think they're going to go. Oops, I forgot something, though. Um, let's see. So I'm just kind of going through. I'm going to leave the lights for now. Obviously, that mirror is going to go. Honestly, I think I'm going to keep everything in the bathroom. That mirror can go. These doors. So this is interesting. So we have a front entry. A bedroom. Hmm. Oh, I gotta think about how to do this. Let's see. Yeah, so like that shelf can go. So can that. These cupboards probably, but you know, like this chair these chairs actually look not too bad. This table looks really weird, so that's gonna go. That's gonna go. The couch doesn't really look that bad, but those things got to go. Pictures are going to stay. This is going to go. That's got to go. Oh, gosh, we missed a spot here. It's funny that it's not showing on my mini map. Okay, I think, I think that's good. Okay, so what else do we get rid of here? I guess this has to go. It's too bad because it... This isn't just dirty, is it? Hmm. I mean, I doubt we're going to keep the pink couch, but I'm just going to leave that stuff for now. And let's see what else. I want these jeans. I think that's so cool. We could put them in the bathroom. Or not the bathroom, sorry, the bedroom. So I got some plastering to do, obviously. I think I've gotten rid of most stuff except for probably this desk and the couch all right so what are we gonna do here guys so this is kind of a cool little entry hmm. but I mean we could open it right up so this is a bedroom right yeah where it could be a bedroom I mean we don't even have to Ooh. Hmm. This could be a bedroom. We could actually open this wall up and have an office in here, maybe. That might be kind of cool. This is a huge room, but we could make it smaller for an office and make the living room even bigger. That might be kind of cool. Because the kitchen actually isn't that big, but... All right, all right, so there's an option. Um, okay, you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm gonna plaster, and I'm gonna make some installations so we can see what kind of stuff we have to deal with, because I like to know where the radiators are going. All right, guys, I'm in the bathroom now. I've gotten most of the place, I think, plastered. Haven't sold the plaster yet in case I come across anything else. But I thought we would start in the uh, bathroom because I can't see changing much about it. So I don't think I want to make it bigger or anything. So anyway, so these are some of the blues. I think we're just going to work with it as is. We can decide what we're going to do here. But these are some of the blues that we can work with. Um, there's a pistachio in there too. I just thought I would check it out. What's that one though? Is that a blue? Oh, that must have been the... Oh, that was the sky blue. Okay. Just looks a little bit more green. Okay, so... 
I do like this this countertop and I actually kind of like this color with it that is the cobalt blue I believe yeah and this is the moody gray or something gosh I can never get these colors gray fog that's what it is and moody cobalt or the darker woods so this one on the end here and this one here are the moody cobalt which I, I kind of don't mind. This lighter one looks kind of nice too. So I'm thinking tile around the bathtub would be a better idea. So let's look at wall tiles. Maybe that will help us decide. All right, okay, so there's these light blue. Well, that's kind of a nice color. Now what would that look like with Hmm, okay, that's an option. There's these. So does that blue stripe then go on every tile or it's probably just along the top or something? Okay, so that's an option. I don't know if I like that as much, but it might be all right. There's light blue, two shades of white. Oh, there's a darker blue. Hmm. That's not bad either. Okay, ceramic, and then there's gray, which would be an all right color to go with it too. That would be not bad too. Hmm. Okay. <sighs> I don't know. Gosh, it's gonna be so hard to decide. Let's buy a couple and see what they look like. Oh, look at that dark green. That looks actually kind of nice. So let's grab this, this, and should we do the lighter shade of, oh, they have, okay. Let's try this one. Okay, oh gosh. Okay, so we want this one. Well, that one's gonna be pretty basic. It's just gonna be your gray tile, which, you know, it wouldn't look too bad because you don't wanna have too much blue in here. Oh, and that looks so pretty too. <laughs> oh gosh, it's gonna be so hard to decide. And that's just a lighter, another lighter shade. Now for the floor tile, do they, oh, they have the two. So we could actually mix and match maybe. What if we did something like that? So this was the darker one, I think, is it? I think so. So let's just see what this looks like. Yeah, we could do that. Or we could do the lighter shade on the floor. Oh, so many decisions, guys. Um, I'm just trying to look and see which one looks better with what color blue. So I'm not sure I like this color with this color flooring. Well, that's kind of a fun floor too. What does this look like? Oh, it's like so random. All right, guys. Well, after buying every paint in the store, <laughs> I had just originally tiled with this and I just decided it's gonna be too much blue. I'd rather have a neutral color and then accent with the blue. Cause I just, I don't know, this was reminding me of the first bathroom I did or the, I don't know if it was the first one, but one of the other bathrooms where I did a dark kind of blue gray color with blue I don't know I just want to switch it up so I decided to go with those those random gray tiles which I think look really nice so I put them on the floor and I put them on the back wall and I think I'm gonna leave it at that and then I think what I'm gonna do is paint this dark gray I was just trying it out to see how it looked and I'm liking it so far and then we'll accent with blue. I think that would be really nice. I don't, can't remember what color I did this. Okay, so I wasn't sure if I was gonna do it white or, so I think what we'll do is now paint all of this in the dark gray, and then we will use some hopefully lighter blues to kind of go with it all. I think that would be really nice. because so we, we don't wanna overdo the blue. I keep, as I'm doing this too, I keep thinking about the other house. 
and I remembered Sirius telling me that I put the TV in upside down. Totally forgot to fix that. So obviously the people didn't mind that the TV was upside down. Um, and I was just thinking about the bedroom there and I was like, oh man, I should have did more. I could have put a lamp in there because um, I forget about desk lamps. I don't use those very often. So there's so many things. I always think about everything that I should have did afterwards, but oh well. Okay, so we will keep on going with, yeah, this stuff. Perfect. I think this will look really nice, actually. It's going to look so mushing. Yeah, I'm glad I'm getting rid of all the blue. I kind of like the gray tone a little bit better. Wow, that did the whole strip. Nice. How's that looking? I like it so far. Yeah, so now we can see with the little splashes of blue here and there, I think that'll be really, really nice. Now, did that light come in white or is that white? I just gotta check here really quick. Um, is that under lamps? Yeah, these lamps I never go and look at. I don't know why I never get desk lamps for bath bedrooms. I always forget about those. So where in where are those lights? Lamps? Oh, they're under sconces. Okay. Just wanted to look at this again. So we got the steel. Okay, okay. The dark steel wouldn't be bad either. Ah, I think that should be fine. I think that should be fine. That socket even looks silver. Oh, and that does too. Oh, well, that looks really good actually. I'm glad we went with the grays then. All right, so now I don't think, did we try a curtain on this? This looks like one of those ones that the curtain won't work. Oh yeah, no, it won't. Okay, so no curtain in here. If anything, um, can we put one on this wall? Yeah, we can. So we might do that. Okay, so let's see what kind of colors we can get. Um, do they have blue? They have baby boy blue, but we don't want that. The gray flowers wouldn't be bad. Blue. Ooh. Just give it a try. Hmm. Okay, well maybe. It's a lighter. I mean, it looks good with the light. Let's see what kind of carpet we can find in here that will go with it. Because I think that'll help me decide if I want to keep that. Oh, back to the carpets though. Drives me crazy. This is the carpet that I got for the other bathroom. So it does look nice in here, but I don't want to use the same thing over and over again. So let's see what kind of blue they have here. Oh, that's just blue and blue. I mean, that could be as good as it gets. It could be. Oh, could we actually get away with using this crazy bright blue carpet? I just feel like I have to use it somewhere. I have to use everything somewhere. It actually doesn't look too bad in here, but it's, ugh god awful looking you know guys i don't think that i'm feeling these blue curtains i don't know i might just leave it maybe we'll just put blinds up and call her done let's put um yeah ones that open we might leave it at that we might okay so let's put some decorations up because we need some pictures oh you know what I always forget too? That's another thing. I was wondering if I put in the other, uh, where is it? It's under bathroom. The toilet paper holder. Always, oh, I already put one in here. That's right, okay. I was thinking about it earlier. Okay, so um, nothing else in bathroom. So let's go to pictures. So we need grays and blues. Those kind of pictures might look okay in here. Some snowy kind of, oh, how many are there? There's these two that kind of match. So those are an option. Let's see what else we have. Oh, there's all these ones too. Hmm. Those are big, those are really big. I don't think I could fit two in here. Yeah, that might be a bit much. Um, that's not a bad size for in here. Those are kind of some nice colors nice bathroom picture too a water scene you know what let's do that I think uh, now let me just see 
Is there any white framed ones that would go with it? These all have brown frames. Yeah, I think we're gonna go for this one, guys. I think this looks good. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, so actually we could probably put those, was it, where were those smaller ones? Um, let's put these snowy ones in. Let's just see here. Should we put them against the tile or here? I feel like maybe here. Yeah, that adds a little something. Okay. All right, so now do they have, let's go to other, get our trusty candles because really that's about all we can decorate with. Oh, they have some nice blue vases. Ooh, 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 snake skin, that's a nice manly thing. Can I put it on here? Turn. Can I put it up here? These things are so temperamental. Okay, can I put it up here please, please? Well, that's dumb. I thought I could put vases up on. Oh, you know, I've had vases on windowsills before. It drives me, it drives me. Well, vases don't work. I even thought maybe some cool blocks placed in here might be kind of cool, but no. So blue candles it is. Are those not gonna go up here either? Honest to goodness, I've had blue candles up in bathrooms before. What is going on in here, guys? That is so weird. I can't get these candles to go anywhere. You know, and I've had them up on things before. Okay, well, that's going to really limit us. I don't see how that's dark blue. Maybe we could stick this in a corner. Can we put it back here? Really? Oh, there we go. I mean, it's at least something to put in here. Hmm. Oh, check this out. We can have a blue sconce in here. So what kind of wood do they have? They have the light, dark, chocolate beach. Oh. Well, I mean, it's at least something to put up here. You know, like, I mean, we need something in here. Like, I feel like there's no color in here now because there's not a lot of options. That's neat though. I didn't know that you could change the color of those. So now it's making me think about all of these. Can you change the color? No. This one comes in, oh, baby boy. That's kind of neat though. I don't mind that. At least we can have a color. So what kind of colors does it come in for future? Cream. Okay, so just the three colors. That's all right though, I don't mind that. Okay, cool. At least we got something. So, hmm. Can we put toilet paper out on the counter? <laughs> no, can't put anything on the counter. Okay, so let's go back to candles. I'm gonna get a couple of blue candles and at least put them on the floor or something. Oh, that's gonna be dumb. I was gonna put them in this corner, but now we have that thing. I just don't understand why I can't put them on the tables and stuff. I just keep trying because I've done it before and I don't understand why I can't now. I thought I would put just at least a couple more pictures in here. Kind of in and around that sconce. I don't know. I mean, it's not bad, it's not bad, but I just wish there was more decorative things to work with. I really do. So how big is this one? I mean, that'll at least add a little bit more color too, even though it's not quite the right size and it goes under the toilet a little bit. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I mean, it's not bad. It's it's pretty plain, but I mean, we're limited with what we can decorate with. And I don't want to decorate with the same pictures all the time. Like this one would look super nice in here and be lots of fun colors, but it's just, I always use this and I feel like it's just nice to have something a little, like use up some of the other stuff that they offer. I wanted to just see what it looked like because I know I would love it in here, but I don't know. This looks all right, I think. I think this will be good. I don't think I'm gonna bother with the blue curtains. The only curtains that I could maybe try are the gray ones. And that would just be to see if it adds anything. 
So let's just try it. We'll just see what it looks like. Yeah, you know what? I kind of like that. I do like that. It's too bad I can't put it on that wall too, but it kind of blends nicely with all the colors in here. I really want those blue candles, but I just can't. I can't put them down. I mean, I could put them on the floor, but I think I do have to get rid of that sconce. Although I really like it in here, I just kind of, it just looks a little bit out of place. So we'll leave it with just the, the pictures here. And I think that'll be fine. There we go. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it is it is what it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. That's going to be our bathroom. Let's give this thing a door, and then we're going to call it done. Um, are we doing white in this house? I don't even know yet. Or are we going to do a dark door or something? You know what? Maybe I'll leave it for now. Um, I've got I've got to get rid of some of these paints. I don't want to get rid of all of them because I might use them somewhere else. So maybe I'll just leave them out here for now. All right. Okay, so bathroom done. It's a fine bathroom. It'll be fine. It's looking good. Okay, it's a start. Um, so next time we come back here, we got to decide what we're doing. So I can either, my thoughts are this, open this up, have sort of an office back here. I mean, we've never done two bedrooms. We could have, this could be an office, I guess, too. That could be a bedroom back there. I kind of almost want to take down this wall and, I don't know, do something kind of big open office living room kind of area is what I'm thinking. We've never done two bedrooms. Well, I guess we have. We've had that guest, guest room. So I think this would make a fine office. We can make this into a bedroom. And then we still have all this for a kitchen, which is going to be super huge. So when we come in this door, I mean, this is a pretty big space. We, should, we can actually have like a partial wall and sort of, hmm, that might not be bad. And have an entryway kind of into here, like have like a, a partial, yeah, that might not be bad at all. Let's see here. I think that's maybe what we're gonna do, guys. I think that's maybe what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna leave this entry because we could actually build that off today, but I kinda wanna see how I'm gonna lay this out first. So, yeah, I think I might have the bedroom off to the left here. Again, it's going to be kind of a small bedroom, but yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. So, um, I think we're going to end it here. This may end up being kind of a short episode, but I think while I'm off camera, I might even actually tile the outside of this. We've, we don't do that very often. So, yeah, I haven't done the outside of one for a while. What is this bright? Like, are these meant to be outside or inside? I just want to see what this looks like. A little wood building. That looks to me like it should be indoor paneling. Maybe we'll just make this white. Yeah, I think we will. I think we're going to change this white. I'm not really digging this brick look. I mean, we could have part of it brick and then go into tiling. What would that look like? That might be all right. Let me work at this, guys, and then we're going to end it. I'm going to kind of fiddle around with these tiles a little bit. It takes forever, so I'm not going to drag you guys through it. But I'll see what it looks like, and then I'll bring you guys back and show you the finished product. All right, guys, I'm done the outside. So I just kept the bigger part, all the brick color, and I used a white tile around this side, put in this nice kind of medium brown door in, and I did the same thing to the back. So I think it looks really mm. good. Oh, that was a weird sneeze my dog just did. Anyway, that kind of completes the outside gives it a little bit of a different look. I put the same matching door on the back. So we got our front doors 
front doors, front and back doors done, and I put in the same sort of color in the bathroom. Added a plant because I realized I forgot to put plants in here. Really am bummed out that I can't put anything on the ledges, so it seems a little bit plain in here, but you know what? It's, it's all right. It'll be fine. And we're going to dress up the rest of the house. So, so next time we will uh, get started on, I think, this room. I do believe, unless we do the bath, the bedroom. But I think we will at least start tearing down some walls so that we know what we're doing. And then we'll get going. This will be fun. I'm looking forward to this house. I like the layout of it. So we'll see what we come up with. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for your support on the series. I really do appreciate it. I'm really enjoying this game. And this has been a lot of fun. All right, guys. We will talk to you guys all next time. See you. Bye.